What is a physical trait that almost half of the top most popular dog breeds have? Pups like the French Bulldog and Boxer have flattened faces with shorter muzzles, called brachycephalic. They differ from what you see in other canines like the German Shepherd or Golden Retriever with their longer snouts. The degree varies across the board. The number of pet owners with brachycephalic breeds have soared in recent years. There's a lot of speculation about what's driving it. Some think it's the shape of the face, which gives their dogs an almost human-like appearance. There's no denying that a pug puppy is adorable, especially when you combine his looks and personality. However, it's essential to understand that the genetic mutations behind the face profile of these pups carry health risks. In this video, we have listed the top 10 brachycephalic dog breeds. Number 10. The Pug The Pug is likely the first dog you think of when discussing this physical feature. Interestingly, Chinese emperors preferred their dogs with this flat face and encouraged the pup's selective breeding. This pooch makes a delightful pet. He is affectionate and quite loving. He's also a character and will have you laughing with his antics and his adorable head turns and facial expressions. Number 9. The Boxer there are so many good reasons to fall in love with a boxer. He's playful and loving, with seemingly boundless energy. He strikes a handsome figure too, especially if you monitor his diet and body condition closely. As sweet as he is, it's hard to believe he served in war and hunted big game like bears. However, it explains his strength and endurance on long walks. Number 8. The Pekingese the Pekingese also enjoyed his status as a royal favorite. His history goes back to 200 BC. Like other related dogs, the popularity of these pups skyrocketed around 800 AD, bringing this breed to Europe and beyond. He retained the gentle and affectionate traits that have endeared him to so many people. However, he isn't as vulnerable to brachycephalic issues. Number seven, the Boston Terrier. The Boston Terrier is a firecracker that is intelligent and therefore makes it easy to teach him new tricks. He's appropriately named since that's where enthusiasts selectively bred him to the pup we see today. Unfortunately, he is prone to many of the brachycephalic conditions, particularly eye problems. As with all pets, regular veterinary care is imperative. Number six, the French Bulldog. Just one look at the French Bulldog and you'll know why this pup ranks number four on the list of American Kennel Club's most popular breeds. He makes it so darn easy to fall in love. He started as a working class dog with the English lace makers. It wasn't long before he was walking the streets of Paris and hobnobbing with the wealthy. French Bulldogs make wonderful watchdogs, but they can become territorial. Number five, the Bulldog. Americans love this type of dog, which explains why the Bulldog is right after the French Bulldog in popularity. Both breeds are calm, which makes them excellent pets in quiet households. Unfortunately, this pup often has serious brachycephalic conditions involving respiratory issues. His energy level is fitting because he can quickly become overheated if playtime becomes too intense. Number four, the English Mastiff. There's no mistaking a Mastiff when he enters a room. For as big as he is, he carries himself well. He is a gentle dog with an easygoing personality. As you may surmise, he began as a guard dog with a history going back to 4500 BC. Like the boxer, he also served in war, both with the ancient Celts and during the last century's world wars. Selective breeding nurtured the desirable qualities this pup has today. Number three, Dog de Bordeaux. The Dog de Bordeaux has the distinction of being one of the oldest French breeds. He was, and probably still is, a watchdog par excellence. He is loyal and loving with his family, even if he isn't chasing off poachers. Unfortunately, the breed has several potential health issues involving joint development and life-threatening bloat. Number two, the Japanese Chin. 
You know to expect the unexpected when you meet a Japanese chin. This pup has an exotic looking appearance and an almost feline-like manner. Curiously, this dog's origins lie in China instead of its namesake. He has all the boldness and spirited behavior you'd expect in a pet that lived with the nobility. He was unknown to the Western world until Commodore Matthew C. Perry brought them to America. Number one, the Bull Mastiff. One thing you notice when you see these types of dogs side by side is how different they look. The Bull Mastiff is a bit smaller with more brachycephalic features. That means he's more susceptible to respiratory issues that are imperative to monitor. This pup has a presence that shows his fearless nature. After all, his job involved tracking down poachers to give them a fright, but not hurt them. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. Which is your favorite brachycephalic dog breed? Let us know in the comments. Here are some other cool videos I know you'll enjoy. See you guys later.